to she's a lot of stupid, white people Larry? say to, to black people. I think you're stupid for saying that kind of thing to try to get black that people. That wasn't my question. That race and racism. Do you think racial genitalia when it doesn't? Do you racism think she's is not stupid, a major Larry? In America anymore, Pierce. Racism is not a major problem in America anymore. The number one problem facing black people are the large number of black people born outside of wedlock. Seventy-five percent in 1965 percent of all people in this country were born outside of wedlock. Fast forward, Pierce. The number now is 43 percent. You look at that for crime, dropouts, all that kind of stuff is connected. The other big problem facing black America, Pierce, is the economy. One in two black men does not have a job. And uh, one of the heads of uh, the Congressional Black Caucus once said, if uh, a, a white person were in the White House, we'd be marching on the place because of the high unemployment. But we're talking about Trayvon Martin and George Zimmerman as if it's the number one problem facing black America. It isn't even remotely on the top ten list. Okay, Pierce. Larry. Larry, this isn't a sort of competition to see who can be the greatest filibuster in my show's history. I'm not so trying to filibuster. I'm just trying could to just get make back, some common sense let me just I'm not get hearing on your show. Let me just get back to the question I asked you and see if you can actually answer sure. the question. Do you think that Rachel Gentel is stupid? I think that I would rather have a George Zimmerman living in my neighborhood, and maybe if a George Zimmerman were living in my neighborhood, we'd have a few fewer Ario Castros. I thought we wanted people to be proactive. I that thought wasn't we the question, to Larry. Something, say something. I know I'm answering something different that ought to Could be answered. Could you just answer You're my question? You're treating George Zimmerman like he's some sort of criminal. He's not a criminal. He's George a guy Zimmerman who cares about his neighborhood. George Zimmerman shot dead and unarmed teenager. He's a guy who cares about his neighborhood. He's a, neighbor, he's a neighborhood watch guy. Don't you want people who are proactive? And there was crime in that neighborhood, Pierce. Mm. I live in South Central. There Every wasn't crime from, there wasn't crime from Trayvon there, Martin the in that neighborhood. Are not on there, the burglar bars are not on there because of George Zimmerman. They're on there because of the minority of thug in the community that's messing up everybody's image and reputation. This is why people profile. Instead of being angry at George Zimmerman, be angry at the minority right. of the thug who's committing these kinds of crimes. Okay, if I could jump in again. So just to clarify, sure. though, Trayvon Martin wasn't committing crimes in that neighborhood, was he? It was an unfortunate incident. Two people had preconceived notions about each other. Mm -hmm. It never should have been happened. Doesn't make George Zimmerman a criminal. I used to work in.